Hey everybody, it's I Want to Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing Homepage Application Dashboard on Windows. To begin, download the latest release of Homepage from GitHub. Then download the latest LTS release of Node.js. With both downloads completed, navigate to your downloads directory and launch the Node.js installer. Step through the installer, accepting all the defaults. Make sure to select the option to install tools for native modules. Once the installation completes, a PowerShell window will launch. Press any key to continue, then press any key again. This installation can take 20 to 30 minutes, so be patient. Once it completes, press Enter to close the PowerShell window. Back in your downloads directory, right click the downloaded homepage archive and extract it to a folder. Rename the extracted folder homepage. Then cut the folder and place it in a location you'd like to run it from. I'll be using C program files in this example. Navigate inside the home page directory in its new location, then while holding the shift key, right click in the white space and select open PowerShell window here. We'll install the Node.js package dependencies using npm install. Then we'll make a copy of the default configuration directory. Then we'll use npm run build to build home page. Once the build process completes, we'll use npm start to run home page. If prompted, select allow to allow network traffic to reach the application. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host, colon 3000. We now have Homepage running on our Windows device, but let's take it a step further and have it start when Windows boots. Open the running terminal and press Ctrl C to kill the running Homepage process. Open a text editor and paste the start command from the video description. Save the start command as homepage.bat in the homepage directory. Click the start menu and search for task scheduler, then launch task scheduler from the list. Select Task Scheduler Library, then right click in the white space and select Create Basic Task. Enter a name and optionally a description for the task, then click Next. Select when the computer starts, then click Next. Select Start a Program, then click Next. Browse to or type the path to the homepage.bat file, then click Next. Check the box to open the Properties dialog, then click Finish. Click the Change User or Group button. Then type system in the box and click OK. Check the run with highest privileges box, then click OK. Right click on the new scheduled task and select run to execute it. Homepage should now be running in the background from the scheduled task. 